All right, everybody, we are back with the final countdown uh, for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. So let's see what we're going to get into if this is the last uh, mission of the game. And hope you enjoy. Belikov really came through in the Soviet Army. Not time you caught up, Woods. No way I'm missing this. Motherfuckers are going to pay for right to Lazar. Look at you, James. Solovetsky's two clicks out. All units. Starfish inbound, 400 knots. When that baby hits, we'll have 12 minutes max before the radio towers come back online. Our job is to knock out the AA guns and give our warbirds a clean shot. Let's take Perseus off the air. What is that, EMP? Looks like it. God, yes. Oh, I didn't kill him. Go down, nerd. Stop that. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. What are you doing? Where are you? Where are you playing? Oh, right there. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Staying in front of you, nerd. I hate these guys. Take them down. Wait.
Good here. Shotgun. The power's coming back on. Is that bad? Woods, we're running out of time. I gotta tell Hudson to launch. That's a big gamble if that gun ain't clear. I see the second gun. Well, I mean, you can do shit too, dude. Fuck off. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Hmm. Oh, hey. We did it. Hey, good job. This is a message to Perseus. Good job, team. And those that'll follow. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Do you, Do you have, have an, an update, update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah. yeah. With, With both, both he and Arash Kadavar dead, dead, their the terrorist, terrorist network collapsed as surviving members fought for control. control. With no, no clear, clear leadership, leadership in place, it appears, it appears the Soviets, the Soviets have, decided have decided to cut ties and clean up the mess. The 
Approximately 72 hours ago, the militant's primary encampment was burned to the ground. Nothing but ashes. Apparently, the few survivors that escaped have scattered and gone into hiding. What about Anton Volkov? After his death, elements inside the GDR saw an opportunity to reduce the Russian mob's influence in East Berlin. Two days ago, in a large-scale midnight raid, Stasi swept through the homes of anyone with connections to Volkov. Men, women, and children were all gone before the sun rose. This will be a major setback to underground Soviet activity in Europe. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Adrian Azoulay's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovesky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. Did we? We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance, which of course we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? We may have saved it from getting blown to Kingdom Come, but it's still stacked with Perseus's agents. There is more we could have done there if we'd had the time. And Bell. Yeah, what about Bell? No, see, they're going to Arctic kill him. Air. There's the head, doesn't it? Bell, you sure made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. Hmm. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. I, I do. Heroes have to make sacrifices. They do. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. He's gonna kill me. It was never personal. I knew it. Well, that's it. I thought it'd be a little bit more than that. Um. Anyways. Uh, I know there's some side missions that I guess could be done. If you guys want to see that, let me know. Uh, I hope you enjoyed uh, this this gameplay. Uh, if you did, please leave a like, uh, comment, and don't forget to subscribe.